Welcome back everyone to more Game of Thrones. We're back. We're back with the episode of the fives. When you play the Game of Thrones, you win or you die. Unless you play the Game of Friends, then you mostly win because you get new friends. You also lose some friends because they die or betray you, but you meet, you meet people and meeting a person, even if they later die or betray you, it's still a victory, because you met a friend. Previously on Game of Thrones. You'd help the Second Sons. Guide them into Marine. I can't, Asher. This could be our only chance. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. She's gonna fuck me up. You think you got a reason for the wildling? No, I'm... Uh... I'm a friend. Don't move. <gasps> ah! She's pale as fuck. This is my sister, Sylvie. I have to get in there, Sarah. Lord Whitehill is up to something. He's conspiring against my family. And someone in there is helping him. Andros is hiring sellswords. Hundreds of them. What? He's building an army for Lord Whitehill, big enough to march against Ironrath. Talia, I may be leaving you here with a traitor. Find out who it is. Seriously. And then there's Ramsey Snow. You know what? Rodri! Rodri! I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. He probably freed Griff's and all Griff and old soldiers. I was just telling your sister. Father's been looking to make a match for me. And Talia's been such good company. Think she likes me? Or maybe your mother? Her flower plucked is still a flower. Such a goading. Just dies more quickly. We could be a family, Lord Forrester. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Your mother may need some convincing. She seems like the type to hold a grudge. You didn't tell me he lost his tongue at the twins along with the rest of his bits. I'd say he's in favor of it, but let's put our happy day to the side for a moment. Walk with me. Oh. You won't need your sword. Not where we're going. No. Very well. That was easy. Like, I can't do anything. <laughs> there. Oh, doesn't that feel better? Oh, you're coming too. This is Lord's business, not a child's. I say she comes. I don't trust her with my men. So where are all the inhabitants of the fucking <laughs> of of the entire How town? How fares your father, Lord Bolton? Better than yours. <laughs> wow. Glad of you to ask. I loved playing in the woods when I was your age. Still do. So many places to hide. I've gotten very good at finding people. Roderick. It's all right, Talia. That reminds me. Where's Griff? I expected to be greeted by him on my arrival. You've obviously found him. Bit of a him. disappointment to have to show myself in. And here I had such high hopes for Ludson. Griff and his men are under guard. They have no place here. They do if I say they do. Oh, I really hoped things might be different with you. I hoped we could be friends. 
After all, I was generous. I've allowed you to keep half your forest. Your livelihood. You allowed that, but then the White Yet Hills took it all away. you behind my back and called in the Glenmores. I'm not sure how you managed that. The Glenmores have sworn their loyalty to my father. Lady Elena Glenmore is our guest. The soldiers accompanied her to ensure her safety. If her safety is a concern, perhaps she should not have come to Ironrath. Well, I'm certainly glad we've sorted this out. Thank you for being so forthcoming. I guess. But there's still a price. Ah. Here we are. Arthur! Roderick! You disobeyed me. You right in my shin. Hey, right in my arm. Someone has to pay! You didn't think it would be you. Your damaged goods. Someone else's leftovers. Arthur's done nothing wrong! If you want to hurt someone, hurt me! No, Roderick! Why bother? You're nearly a corpse already. All the more fun! <laughs> no! Stop! Look at what you've done! I hope it was worth it. Is it worth it? Arthur? No matter what we say, he doesn't give Stop. a shit. Please! <laughs> Talia, don't look away. No. It's very important you see what comes of disobedience. Roderick, make him stop! Please, do something! Lord Ramsay, Talia doesn't need to see this. Look at him, Talia. So same... Same thing. Okay. See what your brother's done. Please, please, Lord Ramsay. Sorry, but they'll never learn otherwise. Mercy, have mercy! Mercy, my lord! Did Roderick show mercy to Griff? I this did. This is his fault. <laughs> I did! That's a lot of blood. <laughs> You're right! This is my fault. I told you, Talia. The poor lad's fainted. Let's give him a minute. <laughs> you want to kill me, don't you? Release him. Go on. Prove how strong you are. Do it for Ethan. <laughs> no, Roderick. He's toying with you. Yeah, it doesn't Don't matter. Come on, Roderick. Your little brother had bigger balls than you. I came here to kill you, but now I realize it might be far more entertaining to watch Lud tear you to pieces. I never want to come back to this fucking shit stain of a holdfast. I have sell. better things to do than to play wet nurse to you and Lud. So you'll settle this on your own. Last house standing wins. Otherwise I'll kill you both and be done with it. <laughs> Best of luck. Whatever. Whatever. And one more thing. <laughs> <coughs> Mm. Can't leave a job half finished. Oh, ready the horses. Not sure you'll have much luck finding other allies. He's not written in very well. <laughs> it's kind of just like Ah, Ramsey Snow. I get. He's he's being sent out to just assure le allegiances and blah 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 for Bruce Bolton and the whole Warden of the North thing, but the way they integrate him in the story is boring. <laughs> yeah. 
Or so I think. At least. It's such a defensible position, like, I don't get how you can even get fucked. You have to scale two mountains. There's just two ways of entry. Give me 500 men. I'll hold that for like two years. Bing. A nest of vipers. Uh, let's see what this is all about. That fucking flayed man. that would do such a thing. And Boltons will pay for this. Why's your foliage inside the card? Arthur. Oh, I'm so sorry. I keep asking myself what we've done to deserve such hate. Did we bring it on ourselves? Or is this house just cursed? Ramsay Snow is a bloody savage. He shames the entire North. Yet we're bound by law to obey him. By the gods, I miss the Starks. Yep. But they are fated to Glenmore be fucked Guard as well. Are gone. Ordered home by Ramsay. So much for having allies. Ramsay says he's not taking sides anymore. He means to let the strongest house survive. I intend that to be us, Duncan. But can we even fight them? We don't have the numbers. We don't yet have Ryan back. And if Mir is right about an army from the south, it just seems risky. Yeah. Uh, at least until... Where is he? Where is my brother? Oh, my lady. She's gonna like say, This union was fucked! I don't wanna marry you. Let me through! Elena. Roderick, tell me where he. Oh, no! No! Oh, no! No! Arthur, no! Arthur! It's my fault. I brought him into this. I asked him to help. He did this for me. You can't blame yourself, Elena. He was a grown man. He made his own choices. But he trusted me. He always has. I was there the day he learned to hold a bow. He was so nervous that father called him Quiver. Oh, I thought it was some kind of Legolas quote. He never and wants IRS. to die, like this, tortured, mutilated. Ramsay Snow did this. He's a madman. Ramsay was here because of you, Roderick. If we hadn't been your But did I eyes... hold the knife? Elena. I'm sorry. I didn't even guide the knife. It's just fucking Ramsey Bolton. Uh, whatever. Flip coin. How do I do this, Roderick? How do I keep going? Where do I find the strength? You can't help the dead. So care for the living. For me, that's Ryan, Talia, Mira. And you. Roderick.
You've been such a friend to me, Roderick. <laughs> right from the very beginning. Thank you. Should you try to get some sleep. I'm not sure I'll be able to. But I don't know what else to do. You're not alone, Elena. I'm here for you, whatever you need. Thank you, Roderick. I don't know if I got half friend zoned or if I somehow salvaged that. Ah, there you are. I haven't seen you since the coronation feast. How many ships do you suppose it takes to move an army? Ships? Why in the world would you never mind? Mira, I'll be honest. I took an enormous risk, defying Marjorie to get you into that feast. And you thanked me by making a scene with Lord Andros, in front of everybody. Marjorie saw, of course, and she knew exactly how you got there. Andros was the one doing the yelling. You can't blame me for his poor manners. But he was yelling at you. And it's not the first time you've gotten yourself into trouble lately. Hey! Which is why it's not safe for me to be around you anymore. Hey! Did I fucking Don't. help you get married? Mira, you're not the girl I knew at Highgarden. She'd never be so reckless. And now that Garibald and I are discussing marriage... Oh, let me tell you... can't risk being associated with you. Let me tell you... Not thing. anymore. You know how much I need this marriage. I won't do anything to jeopardize it. Sarah, you can't mean this. I have too few friends in King's Landing as it is. I'm sorry. I really am. But... I... just can't anymore. I fucking assured your marriage. He was asking me all these kind of things it, about your family. Sacrificing so much for your family. Nothing's worth losing your friendship over, Sarah. I would have said the same thing once. Wow. Keep the game going. You know how it is. I better go before she sees me. She'll be a forester. Can I help you? You need to come with me. Now. Why would I? Don't make this difficult. <laughs> mm. You could at least just say, like, hey, we're meeting a person, and that person is X. <laughs> I thought you'd be happier. I'm glad he's dead. Felt good plunging the knife in at least, but it doesn't feel like I expected. I thought I'd feel lighter or something. Oh, we should never have come here. <laughs> what am what? I'm Listen missing the ch fucking. It only holds pain for me, Asha. I was hoping to bury it all with Desor's corpse. I can't imagine what it must have been. Like. Please, I don't want to talk about it again. Asha, you're back. <laughs> Uncle, let's collect our second sons and get out of here. If you did as you were told, Daenerys should deliver. Daenerys, huh? First names with the Queen now, are we? Yeah, what's up with that? I am the Queen! <laughs> I'm gonna get Your fucked. Grace, my nephew has returned from his mission. It seems you played your part in the taking of Marine, Asher Forrester. Did you run into any trouble? Reports from the battle are muddled. Perhaps you can clear them up. Well, my time is short. No battle is without difficulty, Your Grace. But we fulfilled your orders. All of them? I heard rumors of an incident in the city. Do you know anything about it? Uh. 
You offer silence? I thought you told me your nephew is a man of honor. But he cannot even take responsibility for his actions. Your Grace. You killed the Master de Zorzoraza when I told you his judgment belonged to the slaves of Marine. A slave and of now Marine you come did to me kill for him. A reward. Why should I let this pass? Don't you dare. What do you have to say for yourself? Don't. I'm waiting. <laughs> Whatever. How dare you? Not only did you disobey my orders, you are insolent and deceitful. <laughs> insolent and deceitful? You disappoint me, Forrester. I will not be giving you my second son. No. What? I didn't expect but so either Grace, way. The mission was a success. What did I tell you? She was never going to help us. Mm. Your Grace, we risked our lives for you. And you risk them again with your tongue. A new day is born in Marine. The slaves have thrown off the... You know what? There must be a few cutthroats who would fight for the likes of you. Now get out. I'm terribly sorry, Your Grace. You have nothing to apologize for, Malcolm. <laughs> I have other plans for you. Plans for me, Your Grace? Plans that will help House Forrester, I hope. I would like you to stay and serve me. I have a task for you. Your Grace, I... I am humbled. But I owe my allegiance to my family. And they will be grateful for the Targaryen alliance you've helped forge. I am honored you would ask me. Might I discuss it with my nephew first? Do so. But let me know your answer soon. I wonder if they're gonna intertwine... House Forrester consider staying in Essos. with season six of Game I'm of Thrones, not sure. or whatever season something. we're going into next. If she does come to Westeros, we'd want Daenerys Targaryen on our side. And now you've angered her; she may need some convincing. It's worth thinking about. You have to admit, you're right, Uncle. The Mother of Dragons would make a powerful ally. If she succeeds in taking the Iron Throne, she'll be the only ally we need. But whatever comes of this, we still need men who will fight for us now. The Queen thought we might find them here, among the newly freed. <sighs> the little Queen is right. Marine holds plenty of killers, and I know the worst. So what are we waiting for? Let's go get them. I don't know, Asher. They're not like us. To them, killing is a sport. Fuck it's it. Fun. We really need fun some with people. The White Hills, then. <laughs> as long as they kill them, I don't care. Don't say I didn't warn you. I must talk further with the Queen. Don't get yourselves killed. What's going on with the frame rate? It drops. So, where exactly are we going? Now, Into these Marine. used to be slaves. If I had to guess, I'd say they'll be trying to live like masters. Yeah, probably. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and tune into the next.